the question that we all, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us, which is, uh, are parents responsible for bad deeds done by adult children? Right? Uh, adult children, they're responsible for their actions. And they're not children anymore, so adult children doesn't work. Adult individuals, men and women, right? But it happens to be your children. Uh, if they are living with you in the same household and you're responsible for it, you are responsible for everything that happens in this household. And if they openly committing sins, you are responsible. And you cannot allow sins to be committed in your household because you have authority over your house. And uh, this is something that is no compromise whatsoever because you're responsible. It's not just about caring for them is one thing and it's important and it should be there. Plus, uh, you save yourself from the hellfire because you're responsible for that. Uh, if it's something that you don't know about, hidden, uh, and things like this, what a person can do. And uh, the original ruling is that when someone, and I'm not saying this, that this is what happens or should happen because we have to make sure that we take the proper means to protect ourselves and our families, which is a detailed subject, of course. It used to be in the past that when a child becomes adult, he is uh, married, having his own family, detach himself physically, you know, or if they live together, but he is now responsible for his own actions. And we see that in the seerah of the Prophet ﷺ and things like this. But if people continue to live within the same household, mashallah, this is good, but then they have to abide by the rules of the one in charge. And even it's well-known well in any environment. If they don't, what well, people would say, then go find somewhere else to, to stay. But for a Muslim, he should not do this. Why? Because if he does this, and he make them go somewhere else, this can be even worse for them. So you have to assess the situation, not to take them or to make the matter from what is uh, harmful to be even worse. That's why working on them, on their children, and then when they reach the state of being adults, is to advise, is to uh, give the nasiha, to make sure that a person is firm, no sins are committed in the household, and to ask the people of knowledge with regards to every specific situation of how to deal with it, because sometimes it's a very difficult thing. And with the dua and advising, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala protect us and our families from haram. Allah musta'ala.